So we're going to find the composite function. So starting off with f of g, we get um, square root of x minus 1 squared plus 1. You, you, you got to leave in this form because it, it, if you square it out, uh, maybe there, there might be a domain on this. So I'll just leave it in that form. b is going to be g of f. So that's square root of x squared plus 1 minus 1. So this just becomes square root of x squared, which is essentially x. All right, c, f of f, x squared plus 1 squared plus 1. Just leave in that form. And then finally, d is um, g of g. So that's the square root of square root of x minus 1 minus 1. That's it. There you go.